This segment of Panther Sports Talk is brought to you by Lincoln Savings Bank. At home in Iowa, at work for you. Join with you and I head basketball coach Ben Jacobson. This is you and I Panthers are 8-2 and two here at the finals week mark. And uh, coach, just what have you seen from this squad uh, that maybe you've enjoyed seeing them do early on in the season? Yeah, we, we saw it early in our games, the, the unselfishness on offense. You know, when guys are passing the ball and moving and, and uh, you know, we had a lot of work to do early in terms of an understanding of how to play together uh, with this team and making sure we got some touches in the paint, making sure Ben touched the ball. I think we saw that in our first five or six games where we were getting, uh, just getting a handle on that. Uh, but even before that part of it, Brad, the, the guys have always been willing to pass the ball. Uh, it wasn't, it wasn't, uh, from a selfish standpoint that we weren't fine. It's more from a not knowing how we're gonna best run our offense. So that part I've liked the whole time. The thing I've been most impressed with though is, is our defensive improvement. And our, this group, these guys pay attention. They, they really pay attention to what they're doing from a scouting report standpoint, uh, from our individual defense you know, in terms of where to be and how to, uh, you know, how to rotate, uh, the different things that make up your defense. And they, they pay attention and that goes a long ways. Ranking the top 10 for points allowed, credit to that defense. Is that maybe a testament to those big wins that you had over SMU, NC State, UNLV, and UT Arlington? Yeah, we, we were going to have to. You know, our, our offense has still got a lot of work to do. And uh, I like the way the guys have found ways to make big plays and found ways to get Ben at the ball. Uh, Clint's taken over a couple times. Uh, Jawan has had some good stretches. Ty's made some big shots. Uh, I keep going. Spencer's been great off the bench. I mean, guys have made big plays on offense, and that's been important. Uh, but our defense, you know, you watch a game like North Carolina State uh, in the quarterfinals and they get 90 or so to win a game against uh, Arizona. And you got to turn around and see what you can do with them to try to get a win in the semifinals. And our guys were able to, uh, to lock in and, uh, as much from a competitive standpoint as a scouting report standpoint in that game and, and hold them down around 60. So that we had an opportunity to, to get that game even though we weren't perfect on offense. And, I think we've seen that in a lot of our games so far. Talk about a couple of your seniors inside. Bennett Cook, Clint Carlson. You mentioned Clint kind of had a couple of really good games back-to-back -back career highs. Bennett Cook also had a career high 30 against UNLV. What are you seeing from them here this first half of the season? Yeah, they, you know, they've uh, you know they've just changed. Uh, um, you know, and that happens at different points in guys' careers where they, you know, where they kind of get over that hump, if you will, in terms of growing up. And, uh, Becoming the kind of guy that every single day, your leadership, your communication, how you approach practice, how you approach things outside of practice, uh, that, that change has been happening, uh, but they're over that hump now. I mean, there, there's a real change in terms of how they approach everything and in terms of their mentality. Clint has done a, a, an unbelievable job in terms of his leadership. You know, his, his communication, his ability to get on guys when they, when, when they need it right now, his ability to also work with those younger guys to help them get in the right spots. Uh, and then Bennett, I thought he had one of his best games against Arlington. You know, he, he didn't score. They, they were double teaming him and making it hard for him on offense. He played uh, his effort and his hustle defensively, rebounding, working to get the ball. It was at a really high level. And uh, so I just think it's that change from a mentality standpoint. Both those guys are doing great. Those two seniors really making this year's team their team. And we'll have more with Coach Jacobson on that team coming up here on Panther Sports Talk.